now i'll show okay i'll show you some animation uh, things um let me come here okay so this is just a static plane without any movement kind of a slide now i'll just show you um, a model animation what you can do and i will i'll teach you how you can do something like this for a title slide instead of just having a slide like this if you want to animate the text and the images and all that how can you do um you see this okay i'll show that again you press next and then it goes to the next slide and then you see all the text moving wow now i want two more text boxes one should be okay so i want you saw here the text is starting on the top and bottom you see this on the top and bottom the text is starting with uh, you know one on the right side the one on the top is starting from the right side the one on the one at the bottom is starting from the left side right so i have to create two text boxes one on the right side let me make it smaller one on the right side okay and uh, let me make it slightly bigger okay and then the same thing i uh, no this is saturday superman right okay control c control v i have copy pasted and i am bringing it down here and then i have to put it to the left right so this this is these are the different text boxes that you have now you have to go to animations hmm you click on any object let's go here and see it again all of these are happening together the one in the center is coming out okay and at the same time the top and the bottom are moving to the opposite direction the center is coming out at the same time once the center has come out fully then this text is coming one by one letter by letter okay alphabet by alphabet you see this one more time first let's uh, get the colors of the text right so this is the most important uh, uh title so this has to be darker this is the second uh, most important title so same uh, this thing you can choose a slightly lighter color okay or maybe too this. much light prabhu yeah that's too light this is not very important uh, because it's already moving it will grab the attention of your audience so it has to be and it should not overpower the central uh, title so you keep it oh, really yeah. light so you click on the top you click on the menu animation menu hmm the first animation that you want is the the first uh, most important title coming out from the middle okay this is called zoom so how much time for it like how much time should i keep you can give whatever time that's what so maybe 3 4 seconds only then if it's too less no zoop it will go people will not be able to even uh, see that so give 4 seconds uh, we'll come to time uh, in just a minute so select this and then add animation okay click on add animation and then you'll see here zoom click on zoom ha now this is very fast uh you see here so you have clicked on zoom but it is coming now if you go to uh the animation it's happening very fast but i don't want it to be so fast 
so you can increase the you see here in the animation uh, uh, menu you have something called as duration okay so now it is 0.5 seconds that's half a second the whole animation is happening i will make it at least say four seconds or three seconds so you'll make it four seconds enter okay now you see it'll come out slowly okay now it seems little good the next one is this one we will come to that but along with that something has to happen okay that is the top and the bottom text moving simultaneously to the opposite directions add animation you see right at the bottom you have more motion paths okay you select that okay now scroll down a little bit and then you will see here move left you want this object to move left okay so you click on left and okay now you see that the object is going to move left but it is not moving out of the slide altogether it's just moving a little to the left so what this you know you can see here one green color dot and a red color dot this green color dot is saying that the object is starting from there and it is ending here okay that is what the uh, dot is saying now what you have to do is go to the top just hover your mouse on the top of the red color dot now it will change to this arrow two headed arrow select click on that and then drag it to where you want it to end way outside the slide you take it outside the slide you see at one point you will see the dotted lines turning red you see the dotted line which is extending between the two objects can you see that right no. so at one point it is turning red can you see it now red that means yes, yes. The, the beginning and the end are aligned to each other you can even take it here it'll go up but i wanted to move right so now bring it to the red point uh, yeah now okay and then keep taking it out 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 okay it's not out enough so you scroll left here and then again select this take it right out of the slide wow okay so now let's try the animation again okay so this is happening and then one more click and then woo gone but too fast but i want this to happen with the same time as this one becoming a super kid the main title they have to be of the same time so this one you see it's 2 minutes uh, sorry 2 seconds so make this also 4 seconds that's it same thing you do it for the uh, the one at the bottom so can anybody tell me what i should do what should i do add animation add animation very good then yeah prabhu click on more oh, motion paths more motion paths more motion paths then left scroll down right scroll down and right 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 okay so it is stopping here so what should i do drag right to the end of the mouse please we have drag what the red the red point out of the slide red dot very good so hover over it click on it and then drag it right out of the slide okay until the red you see the red dotted line now yes prabhu drop it that's it okay so now let's see this is coming okay then abo is this how you make your like uh... powerpoint the, like your uh, like your intro for your normal yeah yeah many uh, i mean i have used in some places not in all but some places i have used this
Yeah, probably because like uh, I've seen like this kind of uh, animations and all that. Okay, so now what is happening is it's all happening one after the other. Okay, one after the other, it is happening. But I wanted all of them to happen simultaneously. How do I do that? Okay, select. You see this start in the in the menu. Okay, click on click. and then you say with previous with previous means all of them will happen simultaneously with previous now let's try okay f5 how much send did you put for uh, 